Hi, I'm Larry Shannon A with Engage Machinery, and today we're going to talk about the QXS 16C power decoiler uh, with coil cart. The uh, this is a 16,000 pound power decoiler. Uh, the coil cart uh, you can get it with or without it. Uh, we also uh, have it featuring at 110 feet a minute. Uh, you can also get it at 145 feet a minute. Uh, we the machine that we have is a 48 inch wide. Uh, capacity as far as the width of the coil, but you can also get it in 60 inch wide. Uh, first of all, I'm going to show you loading up a coil. This is about, oh gosh, 5,000 pounds. Uh, we can handle up to 16,000 pounds. Typically with a coil cart, you'll, uh, your change out from coil to coil will be less than five minutes. Uh, the advantages of a coil cart um, is twofold. One is you won't ever cone your material on your uh, coil. A lot of times without a uh, coil cart, your operator will be lifting up on the coil, the outside of the coil, damaging the coil. And two is he'll be pulling off and he'll think he's off the top side of the mandrel, but as he's pulling, he pulls the inner core out. So the advantages are very fast uh, changeover and two is you won't damage your coils. Some of the features on the uh, QXX16C is the slide plates. Uh, we use four actual uh, mandrel plates on the decoiler, and then we have the slide plates that is a uh, on an incline. Uh, some machines that you look at will have, um, you know, on lighter decoilers will have uh, linkages that expand and contract the mandrel. We actually use slide plates at an incline. Uh, this is a power decoil uh, by uh, Hydrox. It has a flow valve in there, so it's a nice fluid motion uh, when it's decoiling. Uh, it's automatically operated by a dance arm. Uh, there's different types of dance arms that you can get on decoilers. We believe in uh, going with a uh, physical dance arm rather than an electric eye. Uh, electric eyes tend to get uh, dirt, uh, and grime on them, and you constantly uh, cleaning the photo eye. With this, it just actually just rides up and down based on the size of the uh, loop, and it's a nice fluid motion. Um, we also like it because it's not having an arm crossed and causing damage to the top side of the coil, which is the good side of the coil. The control, you have emergency stop here, we have this on a magnet, so you can put it on the left or right side of the machine, depending on your orientation. Uh, it has a power on-off. You also have manual and automatic mode, and up and down. Uh, that's uh, pretty much going right to left. Next thing we're going to talk about is you have two pendants here. One is you have the manual to expand the track. Two is the direction. The other pendant for the coil cart to come up, you'll just get in line with it. operator just guides it in. Normally you would uh, have your decoiler lined up with your roll former or your slip and width cut the length line and it would just butt up against the uh, back side of the handle. What you have it there is your lower down We have carpet on here just to, so it doesn't scratch it, but most customers don't. Uh, they'll put just a thin indoor outdoor carpet on it. We'll back this out. Then you'll expand the handle. Put your uh, coils in place. All you'll do is uh, 
Device either roll former or a slitter. 